Okay, we're going to have a look at the 4mm Hard Ox 450 steel keel on the Wattscraft demo boat. We're looking up the bow area here. You can see the steel on there. Now it's bolted on with M8 countersunk stainless bolts. And all the holes for the bolts and for the intake bolts are all cut with the plasma cutter and then also CNC plasma countersunk so you don't have to countersunk this extremely hard steel yourself and you just have to weld up the center here and you can see we've just left the steel bare on the outside here it's a little bit rusty but that's okay and the inside is actually painted black with just CRC zinc black paint because there'll be water in the bilge and it'll rust if you don't paint the inside. We'll go have a look at the back of the boat. You can see there, there's the steel on the bottom. Just scratches in it. We've been bashing this boat flat out and there's no dents in the steel at all. There's dents in the aluminium. No dents in the steel, just scratches. You can see quite a bit of wear on the aluminium bits of the grill. This is the ASP grill here. And there's a few few bends in the in the grill. But the steel is totally sweet, just scratched after 12 hours of pretty aggressive shallow boating. And you can see these are the grill bolts, there's five uh, intake bolts, sorry, five bolts either side holding down the intake. Now those bolts are going right through the steel, through the intake spacer block, and through the intake foot itself and holding it in. And then there's the cutout in the steel for the ASP grill. But we can do them for Hamilton Jet and Southern Jet for bigger boats as well. And you can see the front there, the delta is just wide enough to accommodate the front of the grill the ASP grill and then you can see the delta folds there and two bolts up the front holding the holding the intake in and you can see the delta folds running all the way forward so you can see all these bolts down the side they are all come pre pre drilled and pre countersunk so it's only a couple of hours work to put this bottom on and I'll put some photos in this video of the actual grill being, in, uh, that intake, sorry, the steel keel being installed. Cheers.